And another person in that lineup is Jared Walsh. Maybe him taking the next step. He chatted with Greg and Kevin. Here with Angels first baseman Jared Walsh. Jared, when you sit back and watch all of the chaos going on with other rosters, teams that are adding, especially in your division, how would you assess how the Angels have done with the roster construction in the offseason? Yeah, I don't think we've made quite as many headline moves as the Rangers or maybe, you know, the Mariners with Robbie Ray, but, um, you know, added some pieces. I think Syndergaard, Lorenzen, Loop, Tapera, all those guys are going to be huge for us on the pitching side of the ball. And then, you know, you got Rendon, Trout, Otani, bunch of studs in the lineup. I think we're in good shape. No doubt about it, but I want to talk about you a little bit personally because you put together a year that was so underrated. Mm -hmm. You look up and you drove in almost 100. You almost hit 30. Uh, talk to me about that and how do we rebuild, how do we build going into this season? Yeah, um, first start to finish season in the big league. So, uh, you know, happy to have a good season, but a lot of things I can improve on too. So just get more consistent with my routine day to day. Um, I learned a lot last year, had some highs and lows. So uh, try to be the same guy every day I show up. Yeah, and you get a chance to see two of the greatest to ever play this game right now in our generation. And that's obviously Eltani and Trout. What do you learn from both of those guys? Oh, man, uh, just work ethic. I think they both get after it. Um, you know, Trout's probably the best player in the world, has been for the last decade, treats everybody on the team the same way. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, when you have uh, headliners like that, Shohei is the same way, really humble guys. So, you know, no matter what success you have, you got to be a good teammate. And you have to be good at hitting with runners on base because those two guys, if you yeah. check out their on-base percentage, I mean, yeah. people pitch around them, you're going to have an opportunity to drive in well over on. Yeah, not to mention they both fly. So if they're on, they're on first base and I hit a ball in the gap, they're going to score. So really appreciate you guys for being fantastic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just Two hit it in the gap doubles, and they're going nice. to score. For yeah. all you fantasy players out there, you're looking for RBIs, you're going to get points. This guy. <laughs> Jared Walsh, have a great year, okay? Thank you. Appreciate you guys having me on. All right, thanks.